What's up, what's up, what's up, folks? This your boy, Nate, from The Urbanpreneur, coming back at you once again. Welcome back. Welcome, welcome, welcome. The new school year is amongst us. 2023 to 2024 school year. We are back. We're back with another school year. This is going to be a great school year for all the hustlers, all the urbanpreneurs out there. I wish peace and prosperity amongst my listeners. It's a brand new school year. Hopskit Drive. Yes, I am coming back. Hopskit Drive. I've already pretty much have my schedule already set for this school year. I think. <laughs> I signed up for the ride series. So I'm pretty much booked. I'm going to be uh, it's going to be good. It's going to be good. It's going to be good. And I'll be giving you guys uh, more videos on that. Also, too, I am partnering with another ride share company. Um, it's not as big as Hopski Driver, Uber, or Lyft. Um, it's called Veo. And it only operates out of Orange County, Southern California. They don't have it in Riverside County. They don't have it in L.A. County. They have it in Orange County. And Veo is, <clears throat> instead of um, transporting kids and teenagers, you're transporting the elderly and people who have doctor's appointments and hospital visits. So I will be starting that and doing that next week and during the school year. So I'm excited. I'm excited to be partnering with two companies alongside my business is still going strong. Shepherds Helping Hands. Shepherd Helping Hands. So I'm still running that. Still running my business. I'll be contracting out to these um, places. And I'm just looking to make more money, supplement my income, boost my income. I'm excited to 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 get the school year started because working with companies and offering services um, to, to help people is very important. I like the mission and I just like the cause. I, I, I feel, how can I say it? I feel like I'm really helping and making the world a better place, helping somebody get to school and to their doctor's appointment rather than picking up some drunk adults from a bar, from a club. Or delivering somebody's pizza. Or delivering somebody's sandwich. And they're stiffing me on a tip. That's just my take on it. And it supplements something that I'm already doing. So. That's a whole nother video. Also too. Also too. There's going to be more videos coming. Um, and more consistent videos coming because now I'm working for two different um, companies and I'm going to be doing um, more tax videos also too because that's coming up <laughs> you guys are asking me these specific questions on I'm trying to say this in a nice way. You guys are asking me specific questions on these uh, the different services that I'm talking about. Hopskin Drive, um, even I view it, taxes. I 
I understand you guys' questions because those are some of the same questions that I had when I first started, but I didn't have a Nate or there was no Urbanpreneur to where I could just go watch the videos and learn all this stuff from and try to sit and ask these specific questions that I wanted to answer to. I had to just get out there and do it and kind of learn it for myself and just learn things off trial and error. I can't answer every last question that you guys ask me and don't take it personal. Because some of you guys are asking me extremely specific questions that I cannot answer. Okay? I cannot answer those questions because there's a lot of variables that goes involved with that. All things are not created equal. I'm going to get more rides than a particular than a particular person in a different area because my area is saturated with schools and kids, high schools, you know, the population is high. So I'm going to get saturated and get more rides than somebody in a more of a rural area. Also, my outlook is going to be different than a than a person who's just an Uber driver or a Lyft driver and they just want to hop on, hop, skip, drive just so they can make extra money. They're looking at it from an Uber and Lyft perspective because I'm getting these questions. Um, can they work hop, skip, drive at night? Hop, skip, drive is for kids. <laughs> You're not going to be transporting a 10-year-old in the middle of the night. I mean, come on. This is not Uber or Lyft. That's one of the reasons why I hopped on board with Hop, Skip, Drive. Because a lot of the places, I already knew. I already knew where to pick the kids up at. I know my way around Orange County. Because some of the same kids that I picked up, the clients that I had, they went to those same schools or places. So I, it was something that I was already doing. So my outlook is going to be a little bit more positive because I'm a life coach. <laughs> and when I was coaching my kids and working with my kids, I would pick them up from school and then start my day with them. I have a few elderly client, elderly clients that I, I um, that I work with as well. So I would take them on errand runs and doctor visits. So my outlook on Veo is going to be a little bit different. It's not going to be money driven. A lot of you guys are focusing in on how much money can you make. Whereas me, as I say all the time, this is a supplemental. So I'm not caught up in the money like that. All right, so some of these questions, you guys just going to have to figure it out for yourself, okay? Now, I don't want to go on a tangent, not, you know, I don't want to go on a tangent, but just go out there and figure it out, okay? Figure it out. What's good for you may not be good for me. What's good for me may not be good for you, all right? So, with that being said, it's your boy Nate. I'm out.